Now we come to the nerve that is the fifth nerve. Okay, the trigeminal very region. We should know that trigeminal nerve is mainly it is mainly sensory to sensory to the face. Only the third part of trigeminal that is the mandibular nerve is sensory as well as it is motor to the masticatory muscles. Right. So for this we can simply put some uh, testing over here. And uh, for this I have to ask the patient to close the eyes so that he doesn't see. And whenever he feels any sensation, he will just say yes. You can start over here and I will tell you the positions of which screen nerve are supplying which area. So here for this we can have a small piece of cotton for the fine touch over here. Right. Do no sensation barabar hai? Yes, sir. Okay. So this is the area forehead that is for the V1 ophthalmic division. This goes up till the upper eyelid also. So it goes for the upper eyelid. Fine. Now this V1, this V1 also reaches the tip of the nose, right? This is the sensation testing for the V1. Now V2 is the maxillary nerve that is from between the lower eyelid and the upper lip over here. The V2 nerve is also fine over here. The V3 nerve that is for the lower lip and the lower jaw particularly. Its branch, the V3 branch auriculotemporal nerve will reach over here also. Yes. Barabana sensation don't throw? Yes. So we have seen the fully. So here we have seen that the sensory uh, nerve findings or sensory nerve examination. Of this particular person looks perfectly normal. For this also, we can take this uh, but then we can have some different sensation of the touch over here with this slightly hard object over here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, so here we have seen the sensory nerve examination. But as we have already discussed, this trigeminal has a third component, mandibular nerve. That is sensory as we have seen the mental nerve, buccal nerve and the auriculotemporal branches of mandibular sensory, but also is motor. It supplies the masticatory muscles. For this, we can ask the patient to cleanse the teeth. So here we can feel the tightness of the temporalis muscle fibers of Chodna. Here we can see the tightness again. Of the masseter muscle over here and the temporalis muscle over here, right? This tells us okay that they are working fine. Now we'll ask the person to open the mouth against the resistance and let's see the resistance. So here you can feel the power of the muscle over here. That's basically testing the late pterygoids and the muscles uh, in the lower part of the mandible. So the fifth nerve over here looks completely fine over here.